Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla, where you watch Decide and Ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Revit Trocadero H2O glove, available at Revzilla.com. Mixture of style, mixture of tech, mixture of weatherproof. Three season cold weather, this is the Trocadero. But let me tell you, it will not break the bank. You're coming in around the $130 mark. Revit continues to impress me with the level of tech and the level of function they're baking into some of these beautifully designed, beautifully fitting gloves. This is no slouch, Judge Schmales. If we look at it, goat skin, pebbled. It carries a very style-centric appeal. It's not overly Euro. It's not overly Road Warrior. It really would look great with just a normal winter coat. Whether you're on a scooter or whether you're fully riding, whether you're riding a Harley, you can wear this black glove mixture of leather and stretch textile anywhere. Now, it also has Thinsulate G, which means three season cold weather. It's Hydrotex, waterproof and breathable. And one of my favorite things about this glove, besides the fact that it looks awesome and is very unassuming, is that the interior, I'm sweating just wearing it today in the studio, it's using the monkey fur. We've all seen that monkey fur. It's that higher loft fleece, very soft, very cushy. They don't use that typically in the more motorcycle technical gloves because it takes away a little bit of the tactile response. But here in this crossover on the bike, off the bike glove, they use it and that's actually super plush and super comfy on my hand. Now, fitment. And remember, there's some liners here. You have the monkey fur, you have the thinsulate, and I have my Hydrotex liner. Still decently tactile responsive when wearing a size large. Revit does a good job for the American market. No surprises there. Use a size chart. A Ferrema reference, first gear icon, I'm a large as well. When I start to get into Alpine Stars, I get extra large. That fits more Euro. This does not fit Euro. This is going to work for the US. And remember, the whole back of this is a stretch textile. So that stretch textile allows it to move a little bit with you, inclusive of this knuckle. Keep that in mind. Remember to click our logo, subscribe to us at Revzilla on our YouTube channel. Love to hear your comments, requests, your feedback. Other thing I really like is look at this knuckle. This is a hard knuckle, but the way that they've baked it in, it gives you a sense that there's some protection there, but it's not molded and over the top. They're not throwing off the stylish lines of the glove. Embossed Revit logo on the finger, they, on the back side of the hand here, they've done a blacked out reflective pop. We already talked about the stretch here, and the fingers are just very simple. Revit's also wrapping out seams around the outside of the finger and capturing the seams a little bit better on some of these gloves. Look at the way that does. It kind of wraps here, it wraps there, gives you a better chance in the low side not to burst that seam. Really just well done, very thoughtful. Their gloves have come a long way. Now, if we move it over here, you're gonna see boxier finger construction, again, more style centric. Remember, they sent me a right hand glove. Rev it out of Brooklyn, I'm not happy with you. Send me the damn left hands. But if we look at it, light pre-curve, box style fingers, connect finger, which means it's gonna work with your iPhone or Android. And again, little bit of a control patch reinforcement here on the crook. And you're gonna have this EVA foam, which does double duty, one for protection, the other vibration dampening right on the heel of the hand. I'll tell you, wintertime riding on my Dyna, this would be a great glove that I would gravitate towards. Doesn't feel overly Euro, and ultimately if I was off the bike and kind of wearing a winter coat, this is gonna look great. Um, just a rock solid glove. Moving into your cuff, not to set it and forget it cuff, you gotta get over the $150 mark in Revit to start to see that, but it's very simple. It's less technical. They're going for function and form without really sliding one way or the other. They've done a really good job. I don't really have any nitpicks on this glove. Again, a lot of guys have done the style pieces, but then they compromise the function. A lot of folks for this price point are starting to work synthetic leather or Clarino. Again, we're talking about fall release of 2016. Not doing it here is a big bonus. Thanks for being good motorcycle product developers, Revit out of Holland. Gold star for you. The next step in your journey is click the info button, desktop or mobile device. Visit the product detail page, read other rider reviews of the Trocadero H2O. You shouldn't just take my word for it. As always, we'll ship it for free over 39 bucks. If you want to talk to a gear geek, see us at revzilla.com or 877 792 9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. Remember, subscribe to us at Revzilla on our YouTube channel. Stay up to date with our opinion, the latest and greatest in the motor universe. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.